Hey everyone and welcome back to some more esports talk. We have quite a lot to get into, so I'm gonna go pretty quick through a lot of tweets. But we have Trainwrecks back in the spotlight for some just wild drama between him and honestly the artist community is what I think I'll call it. This originally started when he was posting about buying an NFT and buying into that. After someone responded to him saying, "What does a Minecraft stand have to do with destroying the environment and stealing from artists online? Let me know, please." He fired back at the Minecraft stands, but also said, "Don't come at me about stealing from artists." I pay the artists I work with double what you and your parents make in a year so shut your dumb ass up instead of being activists on Twitter go outside and do something to enact change you hypocritical effing losers it was then at this point that caused a response from another artist in the community that ended up causing the entire avalanche as we know Trainwrecks is kind of back and forth in the public eye as some people really criticizing him and being really harsh towards him because of all the gambling and gambling streams that he does but on the flip side he gives away a lot of money and pays for a lot of stuff for different people we just covered the story about him giving a ton of money to Ronaldo's mom stable Ronaldo's mom as well as then donating a lot to his chat and giving away a lot to his chat and so it's this kind of coin where you're on one side you get the the gambling and people hating that and how he's you know just doing stuff for tax write-offs this that and the other where people come out and criticize him but the other side where he is you know being a very kind person and giving a lot of money away well this artist decided to criticize him saying ratioed by you ghosting my ass after commissioning me literally on my birthday sharing two screenshots where you can see train messaging him saying need it by next monday and when asked for a clarification on the design he said just a cool shirt design a train on the front and a train crash on the back under it on the front it says train and on the back it says wreck later on we see that he sent him a bunch of different discord attachments with the images on it saying here's the full res and transparent designs i know you needed them today i can tweak anything if need be right off the bat train gets a ton of backlash for this and people saying hey why did you pay this guy we see the dms we see you talking to him and commissioning him why did this never come to fruition and you pay the guy for his work well train decided to clap back later on showing the original tweet asking for art the tweet said can someone draw me a picture of a train coming out of a tunnel with the word train underneath and on the back of the shirt it says wreck and the train has crashed like some cool ass art for merch best one will be voted on and paid well again rereading that last sentence it says best one will be voted on and and paid well he responded again saying first of all i made a tweet saying i need new designs by monday and if i use it i will pay you second my name is train wreck not train wrecks third i didn't use your pg inspired art you're all bat shit oh so getting a little bit heated there as we see that there is a lot of back and forth because he said that hey you guys can put this is basically a contest right i need this art by this day it's pretty soon if you want to send an art for it then you can and I'll use the best one and pay the best one that people vote on as the best and pay you very well for it. So he's not paying everyone. I think that's pretty clear in the tweet that he's not just going to pay every single person that submits some kind of art for it. We also got to see the art that he did make for Train with Train saying, I responded because I pay everyone that I work with very well and you're attacking that with lies. I made a public tweet. You responded with trash art and didn't make the cut. For people still not convinced, here's the winner. F cancel culture. They get it wrong and don't care, yet they're the ones who preach accountability. Then even responding to probably the biggest criticism in all this, with people saying, hey, well, you DM'd him, you're in his DMs. That goes a step further than just some sort of contest. It's like more of a commission where he says, they needed a place to submit and my DMs were closed, so I DM'd everyone who wanted in the first place so there would be a place for them to submit. Train shutting this down pretty thoroughly at this point, saying, hey, there was a reason for all this stuff it was very clear and this guy's just coming after me and trying to you know use ratios and this that and the other to influence people out of all this i thought there was a, a lot of responses that we got to see of people really appreciating train and all the different things that he does i mean somehow we even got to see during all of this he bought some dude selfie for three thousand five hundred dollars just for kicks honestly there's also a ton of different responses i can't even read everyone's just talking about how much he gives back to people or their own personal stories of how he has helped them monetarily a bit of a crazy situation with train as an artist came forward of course to criticize him and he clapped back pretty thoroughly i think this is a pretty typical problem that people have in the community where yes yeah, sometimes artists really are cheated out of their work and uh, people don't pay them well or pay them at all but also we see people trying to take advantage of speaking out against someone publicly and influencing the crowd to make them believe accusations such as not paying them let me know what you guys think about all this and until next time i'll catch you later